Anyways. Oh yeah, I've also actually updated the, the death counter. Uh, which now says, which now reads, every 100 is plus one to the truckathon timer. So we're currently at 10 hours on the truckathon, which is about how long I went last time. We'll see how high that shit can go, I guess. Hopefully not, hopefully not too high. <clears throat> uh, all right, let's do it. Comedy time. Oh, man. I'm fighting Madeir, so this will be funny. 10 hours. 10 hours is what I went last time. 10 hours on the truckathon is doable. 12 hours is even doable. I think the difference between 10 hours and 12 hours when I've streamed for that long already is negligible. What's up, Cyclone? Welcome. But you know, if I die like 400 times to Gale or some shit, then we're gonna start to have problems. Man, I'm really just going right into this, aren't I? Like, I just was sitting on the couch, eating dinner, playing Bellatro on the Steam Deck. Look at me now, I'm about to go fight Medeer. Welcome to the stream, Cyclone. I'm glad you enjoy the YouTube videos. Yo, I got a new video out today. People should check that shit out. Because, uh... It's not it's not doing all that amazing for uh, for views, but I think people will like that that game if they haven't already seen it. It's cloud meat. Anyways, let's do this. I didn't wave at my deer. Oh, he's not done. <laughs> okay, that's a great start. <laughs> right, he's not done yet. He flips around. He slashes and then flips around. Okay. <laughs> Forgot to comment on your new vid. That's the other thing. I don't get that many comments on non-Ultra Kill videos. And the views actually lately on non-Ultra Kill videos have been okay. But nobody comments. I'm like, do I need to start saying controversial shit? Or just playing the game blatantly wrong? Because like, yeah, the comments on Ultra Kill videos are annoying. But like, at least people are engaging. <laughs> You know? It's like, hey, you, uh, you fucked up that projectile boost by 0.5 seconds. It's like, thanks. Glad to hear it. But when I post something else, people watch, but it's just like crickets in the comment section. So I think I need to start, like, saying some crazy unhinged stuff. Or, like, blatantly sandbagging. <laughs> One of the two. Alright, let's wave to Medir this time. Applaud this message? No. Stop! I don't want to... Okay, I rated it good. Can I wave now? Uh oh. I am not... I'm not in this yet. Okay, cool. <laughs> Sounds like you need to act like every YouTuber ever. I'm mostly joking. Oh, I'm one-handed. That's interesting. I hate being in the corner. Here, turn around. Thank you. Oh, that's one swipe. Okay. I'm dead. Cool. I was going to say something. I have to make an I'm sorry video. I, I'm, I'm, I'm joking. <laughs> I'm completely joking. I just don't know why that is. Like, I, I've noticed it. It's a trend that goes back to at least, like, my last, like, four or five videos where they just, like, the views are fine. Like, they're not, like, as much as Ultra Kill, which is to be expected, but, like, they're just, like, they're fine. But then the comments are just actually a, a fucking ghost town. I don't know if comments even actually help with the algorithm. I assume they must at least a little bit.
Not sure how substantial. But like, I can't believe people had nothing to say about clown meat. That game is ridiculous. <laughs> like, I actually just don't believe that you people had nothing to say about that shit. Very cool attack, Medir. However, stands there menacingly. Ow, what the fuck? That's way faster than I thought. Is he charging? Yeah, he is. Fire? No. Charge. Turn around. I don't want to do this. I rolled! <laughs> Got my first two hours on Elden Ring and I'm stuck on Margit the Fell Omen. That sounds like the Elden Ring experience. By the way, you're not stuck. That, that's the one thing I'll say, is you're not actually stuck. You can go anywhere you would like. Margit is your first, like, key target, yes. But the game isn't making you fight him. I'll just put it that way. I like beating bosses. There, there are other bosses. This, this may come as a shock to you, but there are actually other bosses that you could fight. Or you can just beat your head against Margaret. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that either, but... I don't know why I always roll down there. Like, it doesn't make any difference. <laughs> Howdy, my dear. Anyways, I'm just gonna hurry up and stand here. I was kind of erroneously rolled to the left on that attack. I'm not sure why. I'm not sure what really possesses me to do that.
Oops. Okay. That was first hit. Turn towards me. Thank you. God, this positioning is brutal. Let's go somewhere else. Oh my god. What are you doing? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Madeer? There's literally not, like, a magic rain attack in any of these games that doesn't suck ass. <laughs> Why is it so common for bosses that have that fucking attack? What's up, Dave? Dave? <laughs> See you, Dave. <laughs> nice chatting with you. <laughs> Everyone echoes my surprise. How many... Yeah, I don't have a lot of embers left. I really shouldn't be popping those right away in phase two. At this point, I should just save them for heals. <laughs> Dave jump scare. A little bit. Hey, buddy. Doing this again? Should just do resin. I agree.
If anything, I'll fucking do it right now. Keep that damage going. This is cool. Bro! What's with my lock on today? It keeps me locked on when I don't want it and locks me off when I do want it. Fire? Yeah. You fucker. Dude! Uh. So much resin. <laughs> Doesn't it eventually stop working? You did it locked off with keyboard and mouse. Are you joking? It just genuinely sounds like an awful way to play. I wish I could lie. Ming Dynasty. I'm not gonna lie, every time I die to that attack, I've never once known what I actually died to. You know? Cause like, sometimes you can like, you can run into his arms and legs, sometimes you can run through his fire and not die. And other times you just die, and it's like, okay, I guess I should've just, I don't know. <laughs> not, uh, just predicted that that would have a hitbox? Like, what? Very fun attack. Just simply have skill. Oh shit. I didn't even think about that. I'm probably gonna run out of gold pine resin with how, much, how often I'm popping it. Oh, I still got five. Five is all I need. Oh, Gamba, yeah. Did we get- we didn't Gamba at all for Madeir last time, did we? Time to wait.
I stayed locked on that time. That's a rarity. probably roll into that one and be fine. That second one. And then I'm in better position to punish the, the flames at the end. spot anyways. That seemed a little unfair. <laughs> that seemed a little bit unfair. Am I crazy? How many attempts seems fair? At this point, uh, yeah, like 40. I feel like 50 would be too much. It may not look like it on the health bar, but I'm actually pretty close to getting this. 45 is fine, yeah. I don't know, man. These these attempts take forever. 50 attempts would be like an hour from now. <laughs> like, genuinely. I've done six attempts. Wave! Shouldn't be forgetting those things at this point. What was that? Hello, my dear. Oh, come on. Rolling through fire is so funny. Transition? 
Got to be coming up. Wow, I did not think that would be close enough. Oh, that was unlucky. He he just didn't have more room to run. <laughs> so we just fucking attacked into the wall until it was time for him to turn around. That's a bummer. I probably should have been paying attention to that, but alas, I didn't. Thank you, Leave. I'm very close, I think. God, that attempt might have been hitless up until that. I don't think there's much more I can do for, uh... for damage evasion. The elusive Leave. Well, his name isn't Arrive 3D. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, also I think you I think you might have used the wrong elusive. <laughs> hey buddy. Yeah, I was gonna say you've been you've been on the Persona 3 grind. Yeah, that's the attack that got me. I just didn't I just didn't think it would happen. into it. Come on. I I swear I've rolled that that exact way and not died. Man. I'm actually, like, dying to the easy attacks right now. <laughs> Which I guess is good. There's not, like, any one attack that I don't have an answer for. Although I am a little scared of Phase 2 laser. Yeah, I was gonna say, Valentino fucking no life hell divers. He's one to talk. <laughs> what did the save? I guess the big- the key difference is that one of those games you eventually beat, and the other one is like a endless kind of multiplayer type game. We always wave to Medir. Lost Space Vietnam. Very sad day. Are you winning, streamer? I'm... I could be doing worse. Am I winning? I don't know about winning.
but I'm pretty confidently fighting a very hard boss. Never mind, I suck. I just can't go left on that one. Left is so much, uh, left is so much less. So much less reliable. The thing is, when he does that attack, I always am just like, oh, which fire breath is this? And then next thing you know, I'm being crushed. So, that's fun. I'm not even... I'm trying not to think about Half-Life, but I'm like, okay, what am I going to do? It can't be that hard to learn how to parry Half-Life. Just put on the Hornet Ring. Let the parries take us home. Yeah, I saw that article about Joel, the guy who just fucking pulls the levers for Helldivers. Which is probably a pretty cool job. I don't really lose anything for dying, no. I mean, are you asking how the game works mechanically or how this challenge run works? Because normally, yes, you lose souls. I don't need souls, though, because I'm not leveling up. I like this boss, but it absolutely falls apart as soon as you're pushed into a corner. Like, the camera just- the camera actually works remarkably well for Midir when you're in, like, the open. But, like, as soon as you get pushed into a corner, the camera just ceases all function. <laughs> it's so annoying. Yeah, so basically, I am not playing this game normally. That's cool. <laughs> I am, uh, normally you would level up, I would have a lot bigger of a health bar, and I wouldn't get one shot by the funny boss. Um, but I am level one. None of my stats have been leveled up. Ignore the fact that some things say 15, they're being buffed by something else. I, uh... I have not invested any souls into leveling up, and yeah, souls are basically the money in this game. It'll allow you to level up, buy things. I mean, I do still use souls to buy things, but given that I'm not leveling up, it's- it's- they're not as important as they normally are. So I don't really lose much when I die. Yeah, the 15... The levels that are at 15 come from a, a, an item that I have that increases them. I have not leveled them up myself. Hello. Okay. That's a way to start.
No stamina. Fight. It's very well done, the way they emphasize attacking the head. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Whatever you do, don't do that if you're going to take inspiration from this fight. Are you serious? That has to be one of my, like, most unfortunate souls deaths of all time. That hitbox must have just clipped me. That is fucking so annoying. <laughs> what a joke. I'm actually running out of gold pine resin. The good news is, uh, I can buy more. I will do one more attempt before I do that, though. Actually, I don't know. Um, gold pine resin good for Gale? I know dark is good for Gale phase one. And then it kind of stops being effective in phase two. Which is kind of <laughs> uh, hilarious. I get why it's like that, but like... Or is it bad for phase one and good for phase two? I guess I could roll in through that last one. It's more about stamina conservation than anything, though. You are. combo. We're good. For some reason, that one did not have downtime. He normally rests his head after every attack. Okay, no, we're fine. I thought he did one more attack at the end there. That killed me before. <laughs> Frame perfect dodge, hello? I was like in his mouth. Gotta love iframes for that. I 
saw my life flash before my fucking eyes there. This has gotta be, yeah, 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 get me out of there. Got right, my last resin. Now I can join the Spears of the Church. Hell yeah. Fucking locked in with my last pine resin, too. Let's fucking Joe. Now you guys get to watch me fight Half Light, a considerably shitter boss. <laughs> I also have 150k to spend on gold pine resin, baby. Madeira down. I'm still under a thousand, like, raw deaths here, which is nice. <sighs> I'll hit it. Don't worry. There's no chance that I only die 15 times between, uh, Half Light, <laughs> Gale, and Soul of Cinder, but. Okay, let's assess my inventory here. I have 109 charcoal resin. That's fine. We'll, uh, and that's it. That's all I have. Oh, no. Never mind. I have human pine resin. I have 46. Okay. We do need to buy some... Don't say oh, believers man. actually get paid for once. Don't say that. <laughs> what do you mean for once? <laughs> buy like another 50 of, this, of these shits. How about 60 even? How about 69? One. Do the thing? What is the thing? Oh, pay out the believers. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pay them out. Dark should be good against Half Light, actually, right? Oh. Bro. Look at that squat. Hang on. Can't resist it, can you? Oh. My Sorry, Patches. This is important. We don't need Path of the Dragon. Hang on. I want to replace it. We don't need Path of the Dragon anymore. What we need... is to squat with our boy. <laughs> Look at that squat. That's, that's something. That's really something. Oh. Alright. Dark Resin. Give me 54. <laughs> sure. Yeah, I have to beat the boss at some point. I, I don't know what you mean believers never get paid out. 
actually, if anything, other than Dancer, I'd say that Soul Level 1 has been really good for Believers. I think I've, I think I've overachieved on almost every fight except for Dancer. And, um, I'll say, and Pontiff, and Dragon Slayer Armor. Otherwise, I think I've overachieved in almost every fight. And I don't think that's all that insane of a thing to say. Normally, though, you are right. <laughs> and Dancer was brutal. <laughs> that was a brutal one. Can't imagine being a believer during those days. But Madeir, 33 attempts. Not bad. That's not so bad. Yeah, that's... On a, on a long enough timeline, we could blame Pillow for that one. Okay. I need the shield equipped. Does that mean... Oh, how I wish Endurance governed, uh... Equip load in this game. No, we're good. Dude, more like beers of the church, am I right? Half light if he was based. Alright. I'm not fighting this guy. I'll tell you that much. Or should I? I don't think he respawns. God, he's gonna be miserable though. Can I parry him? We'll find out, won't we? Oh! <laughs> that... That's insane. I feel like it shouldn't work that way. <laughs> Absolutely magnificent. <laughs> Warming up our parry muscles. Holy shit, that- that doesn't seem like it should work. This guy is nuts from Burke, bro. I don't think I've ever killed that guy before. That was so easy with parrying, holy shit. <laughs> well, I think I just saved myself a lot of run-back deaths by killing that guy. I actually was not even gonna attempt to fight him, I was just gonna run right past him. It's wild how easy that was. <laughs> it's also hilarious that you can parry dual great swords. Also, I mean, we have to check this out. That's all I'm going to say. I cannot wield this, nor will I ever be able to wield it, but watch this. I think it has a follow up too, doesn't it? Do I have to R2? Yeah. Nope, never mind. Maybe it doesn't work. Oh, does he respawn? I got his weapons at least. That's alright. I'll just I'll just parry him every time. Nah. Um I actually just need to go. Where does where does this go? Is there a bonfire down there? No, there's not. Yeah, this is still the best bonfire. Unfortunate. Very accustomed to this, uh... To this ladder at this point. Ladder. Why did I say ladder? There was a ladder on the Medea run back. This would be an elevator. Yeah, I figured it was, uh, stats were the reason I couldn't do it. I, I think you're right. I can't remember if you L2 twice or if you L2 then R2, like the fucking Bloodhound Fang. Honestly, I should have just gone in. Is 
least they give you a wide berth to run around this guy. Here's the issue though, I gotta open the door. Uh oh. Don't do it. Longest door iframe cycle of all time. I am technically online. I think there's almost no chance I'm... You're freaky looking. I love how he has a monologue so that they can connect you to someone online, but he fucking does it every time even if you're offline. Okay, cool. You're supposed to be Spear of the Church, however, you have bow and you have uh, a katana. They don't ca call you katana of the church. Okay, I just got stun locked. Very cool. Oh, what a shit, boss. Man, I hate how little damage I'm doing to the, uh... Uh, what's it called? The painting guardian guy. Do I just want... No. I actually think I don't want the ornament ring. I think I just want what I have. I don't think Hornet Ring is going to make a world of difference here. God, I hate that this is technically... Well, it's not required, but it's required for Gale. And like, Grave Tender is shit, but at least Grave Tender is, uh... Extremely optional. Yap, 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 yap. When will bro stop yapping? Fuck, stop! Holy shit, I- I'm realizing how much I don't want to do this, boss. <laughs> oh, God, this is brutal. That's two attempts that I'm already like, man, fuck all of this. This boss is terrible, fully leveled. It's not hard, but it's still really random and terrible. <laughs> Hi. Really glad that didn't hit me. 
I guess the good news is if that guy hits me, it's probably just a one shot and then I just go back. <laughs> I wonder if gold pine resin is good here or... Oh, I actually can't even open my inventory here. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. I might want dark resin instead. <laughs> Actual unending yapper. Uh-oh. Yeah, I didn't get the backstab. Oh, that's pretty good damage with the, uh... Fucking heals. What the hell? That's not good. Holy shit, I'm dead if he hits me again. Is this like the Freya fight in Elden Ring? I don't recall a Freya in Elden Ring. My, my inclination is to say no. I think Dark is probably better here. I'm gonna just... rightfully assume. The, oh, Fia? Fia's champions? I don't know where you got Freya. So there's like a there's a Freya in uh in Dark Souls 2. She's a big two-faced spider. Kind of a shit boss. She's got a laser like Madeir. No, I would no, I would not say this fight is like that. Other than that, it's like an NPC fight. This actually is supposed to be online. Like, you're supposed to be matched up with a player. I guess, though, Fia's Champs uses, uh, like, player builds, which is kind of interesting. So does the Great Jars Arsenal. <laughs> if you've done that. Yeah, it doesn't work because I'm level one. It just doesn't match me up with anyone. Whoa! Okay. I'm not, like, thrilled about that, to be perfectly honest. Oh my god. I actually think the lightning damage was better on the painting guardian. Weird. Huge. Nice. <laughs> Imagine if you encounter a level one player. Uh, they would have to be specifically... Here's the thing. Here's the thing about Half-Light. Even if you do it fully leveled, there's not that many people left, like, doing the thing. Uh... <laughs> like, there's not that many people left that are choosing to invade, uh, as Half-Light. Or as, a uh, Spear of the Church. 
So it's it's a toss up whether you even get a player when you play through the game normally, let alone someone at level one, someone who is like finishing the game at level uh, at soul level one, finishing the DLC at soul level one, no less. I doubt they're like, man, I'm going to go invade some other level one players. <laughs> Although I tell you what, BGV's probably thinking about it right now. <laughs> probably put that idea in his head. Yeah, I was like, he's right here, so. Would be funny. I don't know if it work. I don't know if or how it works though. I assume it works. You have to beat Medir, but you have, so. Hello. I don't think I'm on a password. Oh, I might be. I played with a friend and I think we used a password. Fuck you so much, you little bitch. Oh, he's healing, great. Dude, the backstab is actually meaningless. Ugh, you are so fucking annoying! Holy shit! What an actual dog-ass fight. Holy fuck. I can also I can also just remove the password and see what happens. I think the password here, I'll I'll find out what the password was, I guess. Let's see. Poopy152. <laughs> Why was that my password? Uh, just get rid of it. Uh, not like, not like it's likely we're gonna get invaded anyways, but... But then it might make the fight too easy. Listen, man, it's up to you. I don't find it... I, the thing is, even if you're level one... Only professional passwords on here. Yeah, exactly. See, even if you're level one as well, you get the buffs from the painting guardians, and you get a helper too. Not saying you should do it. I, I will. I will sit here and I will fight Half Light if that's what it takes. But it would be funny. I was watching the past few nights. Lil Aggie has been playing through Dark Souls 2: Scholar of the First Sin for the first time, and he is getting some very funny, like uh, stream sniper uh, invaders. I did beat Madeir, yeah. Unfortunately, that means that I'm on fucking Half-Light now. I think- I, I'm feeling like Dark is actually worse than Gold Pine Resin here. I love getting stunlocked. What a cool game. You're healing, of course you are. At least those do no fucking damage. I was like, I'm about to take a lot of damage. Oh my, I thought my sword ran out of dark already. How's Fortnite? So good. My favorite boss. Uh. <sighs> Actually, this is a moment of truth. Let's put... 
uh, gold pine resin on. <laughs> this will be the comparison here. If this is more damage. Fuck Fextra Life. We don't need them. All my homies hate Fextra Life. Hood calculates their own damage values for real for real. On God. <laughs> Let's see. We'll find out. This is gonna be something stupid, like, Dark is technically better for Half-Light, but worse for the Painting Guardians. Last I checked, the other Souls wikis were not as detailed as Fexter Life. Fexter Life still sucks ass, don't get me wrong, but... It's more likely to have the correct information in my experience. But maybe, maybe the other ones have gotten better. Well, okay, I was doing 484 on a backstab before. Okay. Oh, you're healing already? You bitch. So cool. What a sick fight. Oh my god. You know what? I actually don't think I want the Lloyd's rings because they, they only proc when I'm at full HP. And I'm, I'm never going to be at full HP in this fight because of the chip damage. Fine, heal. See if I give a fuck. I hate this fucking game. I actually hate this game. It's so shit. Why am I playing it? <laughs> uh, okay, I still don't know actually though if gold pine resin is better or not. <laughs> I, I only remember- I only have the backstab value memorized. My strat ended up being wait until he goes in a bow and then just wail on him. I feel like waiting is bad in this fight though because uh, more painting guardians spawn. Hello. I guess unless you were just kiting the guardians, but then they heal him. They heal him, that's the thing. Only one more spawns after a certain health value? Eh, okay. I thought they spawned endlessly, so that's actually good intel. Oh, right under me. I hate how it does the animation. God damn it. God damn it. What do you even do about that? Alright, alright. New strat here. 
Well, not new strat, but new ring setup, because the, the Lloyd's rings are worthless here. Do I have magic damage resist? I don't think I do. So we may as well take... Yeah, none of this is very useful. I guess Ring of Favor plus three. And probably Hornet Ring. Our damage is gonna be ass, but... Uh... Whatever. Cause I think Lloyd's is a 20% boost. Or 15%? I think it's 20% defense on the shield ring. 15% increase on the uh on the sword ring i could be wrong but that's what i remember i could try chloranthi ring too i have noticed stamina being a little bit of a problem in this fight although ring of favor should help a little bit with that I did see the Stardew Valley 1.6 release date. I, I've put my modding on, on hold until then. <laughs> but Britta and I are both very excited. It, it actually drops while we're on our trip, or very close to when we're back, I think. It was like March 16th? Something like that? Oh, well, this actually won't be a good way to... Uh judge because fuck when he rolls away I, I know that I need to get out of that shit god you can't even trade blows with him it's so fucked up and annoying Okay, Half-Light. Okay, Half-Light. Cool. <laughs> mm. I guess uh, the Freight Blade is dark damage, right? I don't think I have anything with resistance to that though. Oh, I do. That cannot be better than just Ring of Steel protection. I feel like there's like a there's a hard line in this game. Like fi fights that are bad but easy when you play this game normally are like whatever. Um but when you do them at soul level 1, they instantly become like the worst thing of all time. I I actually genuinely don't know how I'm going to do this. I'm rarely if ever getting damage in on half light. Which is kind of scary. It does not bode well. Cool. That was about as efficiently as I've ever dealt with them before. Oh. 
Okay, cool. I kind of like the boaster at. I won't lie. Switch to the bow? Oh my god. What a cool fight. Miyazaki, you've done it again. Is that the bow? There's the bow. Lock me back on, please. Oh. Oh, very nice. Oh, you take the sword out. Okay. Cool! Fucking great, dude! God, 25 or less is not fucking happening. <laughs> Go for it, though. Someone put one point on Believe. And see what happens. To an 11 hour truckathon, I just noticed. That is better damage. Oh, that's Hornet Rig, probably. Not a parry, honestly. That timing seemed perfect. Is that even parryable? Oh my god, someone. <laughs> someone put it on no. They're, they're getting their money back. I'll tell you what. I'm not even sure if the unsheathed attack is parryable on that weapon. Oh wait, okay, it was 509 damage. All right, that's with Hornet Ring. Let's compare with Human Pine Resin. I really thought that guy didn't respond. I don't know why I thought that though. Now I'm wondering why I thought that. I'm not even sure I bothered to kill him before. No, I definitely did on my first playthrough. Wow, I popped that really early. No, you're right. I don't think trying to parry the unsheath is worth it either. Honestly, I just got caught in a bad position there and it was my only option.
Make haste, he says, after the longest speech of all fucking time. <sighs> 204 with an R2, or R1. Oh, that actually hit. Very cool, very cool, very cool. I love it. I'm having so much fun. What a fun fight. Cool. I'm dead. I already ran out of dark. <laughs> Dude, what a shit ass boss. the fuck are they thinking? What are you doing? Calm down. <laughs> I really want to compa compare the backstab values, but I think I think gold pine resin wins. I guess I can also compare it with the R1 because I remember what that was last time. That still does damage, but it doesn't count as a backstab half the time. It's two more. Wow, two damage more. Oh shit, he's gonna get that off. Oh cool, I didn't even see that. Two whole damage. I love getting stun locked. One of my favorite game mechanics, in fact. I love completely losing my agency. Who wouldn't love that? Oh. Hey there, buddy. I see you. Did you heal again? Very cool and epic. Leave me alone. <laughs> oh my god. I actually think I should just die at this point. I don't know what the fuck else to do. Okay, he never stops. It's fucking endless, dude. Thank God they gave the fucking painting guardians the waterfowl dance. Jesus Christ. This is, like, sapping all of my will to finish this, uh... This challenge run. I gotta fight Gale, dude, but, like, holy fuck. <laughs> okay. We're not doing human pine resin. Just get that off of there.
Need that two damage. That's gonna make a big difference. Water's out. Dude, what is the... I was getting it before, no problem. God damn it, dude. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. I'm gonna lose my fucking mind. The <laughs> princess is Gale. Bro doesn't even know what happened to Filianor. Some job you did protecting her. Because somehow, someway, Gale gets there. I guess it's not, like, implied that Gale killed her, though. Just that she eventually dies of old age sitting there. I'm gonna scream. There's no fucking way not a single one of those attacks landed. God, what a fucking dumbass, shit-ass boss. I'm so mad. There's nothing fun about it. <laughs> Maybe, maybe in PvP, if you're the one invading, it's fun. Otherwise, it is actually so terrible. <laughs> what the fuck were they thinking? It's not even the boss that's the biggest problem. It's it's surviving that first painting guardian. Dude, Miyazaki loves this shit too. I don't know if he's ever said that he particularly likes this boss, but he loves forcing you to do PvP. Like I think he thinks he cooked with this shit. This is like the third time this boss gimmick had been done. What the fuck was that sound? That's cool. He's healing again. Very good. Yeah, no, I didn't want to kill you anyways. I don't want to fight the real boss. I just want to be stuck fighting you forever. It's so fun. With your one frame windups. Oh, I'm getting peppered from Half Light.
Please. Oh my god. I hate you so much. It's unbelievable how much I hate you. Holy shit, you love spamming that thing, don't you? Is there like a certain distance at which you're like, nah, bow time? Or like what what's the what's the deal here? As much as I love seeing a weapon exhibition of the frayed blade. I'm afraid I don't want to do this anymore. Yeah, okay, and you're just gonna unsheathe it over and over and over again. The fucking cool fight. I'm getting dizzy. Ow. It's it's only when he does that spear attack. Okay. Bro. This is unbelievable. No, oh, okay. Like, I'm down to try and parry you, but only if you don't spam this. R1 spam is best. He doesn't keep the bow out long enough for me to spam. I'd love to stun lock him, but it doesn't seem possible. I just want to get caught in like the the fucking fruit ninja attack. <laughs> I don't know what else to call it. Take the bow out. Bitch made. Absolutely bitch made. I'm dead. I don't want to do it. I actually, I don't want to do it. I really just don't want to do it. Don't run up on him if he does the attack because then he will not pull it out. Like, I get that and I, I've noticed that he does that, but he fucking does it anyways. He pulls the sword out as soon as you get close to him. I'm, I'm not sure at what point you have a window to attack him when he has the bow out. Like, do you have to wait for him to shoot? I just not sure I understand. This is actually fucking atrocious to play. Some of these bosses feel like they were explicit fuck yous to people who wanted to play this game at soul level one. <laughs> You? That'd be neat.
This doesn't seem worth it. Because if I miss and I get caught in their shit. Okay, it's a little faster than I thought. Yeah, I don't know if I can actually react to that in time. I'm dead. I'm getting water. I don't want to do it! Make it stop! You know, it's funny, the, the DLC for this game definitely has all the... I shouldn't say all the best bosses, but it has a lot of the best bosses. I would say, without a doubt, it definitely also has the worst two. In Half-Light and Grave Tender. Like, they're just lazy, not fun. I don't know. How did they get made? Well, and they're both they're both stupid like PVP things too. As a as a certified PVP hater, not worth it. Well, and like Grave Tender did not need to be a boss in order to get that PVP thing. Okay, now I'm actually getting dizzy. <laughs> Just make Smegamine dizzy instead. Oh my god. Fuck. I love how those track you for some fucking reason. I don't know why I'm healing chip damage. I don't need that anymore because I since I unequipped Lloyd's. There we go. Huge! That almost couldn't have gone better. Okay, we're spamming again. Cool. Fun. I don't think that's working for me. <laughs> I say, after failing it for the 16th time. Fuck. God, this is- it's so awful. Wish I could, like, pinpoint what I'm doing wrong, too. I mean, probably going for those parries, but, like... Ain't gonna lie. Make it a lot easier if I could parry him. <laughs> uh-huh. Just sto join to see him fighting my third favorite boss. You have to be joking. This boss is a travesty. Oh, fuck you. Wasn't paying attention. That was about as good as that could have gone. Can I backstab you? Oh. Okay. It's an acquired taste. Yeah, you'd unacquire it at soul level one. Okay. I feel like there's a window after that attack. 
Like right, yeah. Okay. Wait, now we're, now we're cooking a little bit. It's a little risky. Oh, what the? You can cancel that? Oh, well, yeah, of course it's more fun online. I mean, I kind of still disagree with that because I've done it online as well. But... I'm healing ship damage. I keep I keep doing that, thinking I have Lloyd's. Get the bow out. No, dude, why did that not give me it he did the animation? Are you fucking kidding me? This boss is just, it's ass cheeks. It's so bad. Man, I don't know, like... The PvP aspect too is like, fine, whatever. But you could also just do PvP. Like, I'm not trying to do PvP. I'm trying to... <laughs> trying to just play through the fucking game. I don't want to get punished with a shitty boss. Ooh. I'm not changing weapon. No shot. Also, again, we're talking soul level one here. Like, very limited in what I can actually use. Every boss in the late game is a masterpiece except this fellow. Counterpoint, Grave Tender is not a masterpiece. <laughs> but close enough. The fact that this gate keeps Gale is so stupid too. Alright, can I get a... Inshallah, I will get a backstab. Oh my god. Oh, not what I meant to do. I don't even know what the dark hand is, to be honest, but I'm not doing it. I missed. Oh my god, you're gonna do it again, aren't you? Very cool. Very cool. That was cool how I turned around instead of locking on. Honestly, just kill me. Anyways, uh, just no vaccine, please. I'll, I'll, I'll ask for advice when I want it. Yeah, that's the other thing. I can't, um, I can't take levels from, uh, uh, what's his name? Yol. Was I, was I vaccinating? Um, not, not egregiously, but... Yes, I would say yes. <laughs> Unsolicited advice is, is indeed backseating. 
No worries. I love how he does a full flip when you backstab him. It's pretty funny. Okay, there we go. That's a good start. Oh, of course, as soon as I come out from behind that. Do the attack. Okay, I wasn't ready. That time I'm ready. Funny, I actually want you to spam that now. Weirdly enough. I will allow it. Uh oh. Can I lock on? Hello? Hello, game? Okay. That's fine. Are you almost done? Okay. Ooh! Careful. Do it. Dude, he pulls that sword back out so fast. Okay. Cool, we're back to this. You love to see it. Ooh, okay. Get me out of that. Oh my god. No, 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 no. He's healing. Whatever, whatever. Okay, cool! Fucking great, dude! That's fucking awesome! I don't know about you, dumpster man, but I've had a lovely time. Boss battles and normal enemies. Swords and spears. The death throes of the ringed city. And you were an avenging spirit, spreading chaos at every turn. It's just as well. The city was dying already, completely rot. <laughs> completely rotten like this boss! This my fucking shit ass boss! Rotten! No good. I fucking hate this shit. I'm starting to think differently about you now that I know you like this boss. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I, I don't know really... I have a hard time seeing what there is to like about this boss, though. Granted, I'm fighting it at soul level 1, but I've never enjoyed it any of the times I've fought it. Online, offline, doesn't matter. This shit sucks. And you gotta wait for it every goddamn time, even when you're fighting it offline. It's the most fun when you are the boss itself. See? I believe that. I just don't agree that that's good criteria to judge the bo actual boss fight itself on. Make haste. How about you make a good boss? So true. Okay, you're gonna heal, aren't you? Yep.
Oh, you're alive. I don't like that. My two least favorite things. When the painting guardian is alive and when half half light is, you know, just in existence. Okay. See, I don't R1 spamming does not seem to work for me. Did you get a different copy of the game, BGB? Do it. I'm dead. Cool. That was really cool. <laughs> it just stopped me dead in my trap. Why did that happen? I swear to God, I was holding down. <laughs> Whatever. This is the worst boss in this game. I used to feel differently, but now I'm pretty sure it's true. <laughs> I guess I felt differently because the first time I did it, I did it online, and while it was very unfun... I don't know, at least it was unique. Going to study coding and game design and make a game? Hey, sounds cool. Don't make a half-light. <laughs> Otherwise... Power to ya. I've been, like, intermittently working on a game, but I've been now too busy again to actually make progress on it. If you made a game, would I play it? I get asked this a lot, actually, and I don't have a good answer for it, but if you make a good game <laughs> that is interesting to me, then yeah, I'll play it. I suppose I'm more likely to play the game of someone who watches the stream. But like, it has to be something that I would want to play normally anyways. That's kind of my criteria. So yes, I am. I'm dead, because you actually can't fucking do anything. Love that. I'm going to have to get pretty lucky with that second painting guardian. Otherwise, I don't see myself getting past this. I'm destroying your chair. Game I'm working on is the Souls like, but there's a lot of dragon themed bosses. Interesting. Take notes from Medir, I suppose. Because I, I, I'm going to be honest, I don't really like the other FromSoft dragon bosses all that much. I guess Sin was all right. I'm not, I'm not a big fan of Calamite, but I guess I like what they tried to do with Calamite. I just think Calamite is uh, suffers from jank. Placidisax is okay. And Fortisax. They're both just fine, though. Madeira's the only one that I'm like, yeah. Uh, he's actually really good. Cool.
Cool. Very cool. Surely you eventually stop, right? Oh my god, I love the hit trading, dude. I have to heal or I'm dead. I might be dead anyways. Cool. Oh, you're healing. Very fun. Very fun. I love just fighting you forever. I'm just taking chip damage till the end of time. No pun intended, given the subject matter of this DLC. I'm amazed that I'm not dead. Oops, I did not mean to do that. And now I'm dead. Nope, we're fine. Do it again. That was... I guess that gives him hyper armor, kinda. Or it gives him, like, increased poise. Something like that. Or her, I suppose. I've never looked closely at the Half-Light. I'm really glad I have Light Roll for this. Shut up. Okay, cool. Oh my god. I'm so fucked. I'm fine. Was never worried. Dude, why do even the shittiest bosses have to have great themes in Souls games? I can't even damage this guy. Oh cool, I'm dead. Oh cool, I'm fucking dead. <laughs> Good boss. Yeah, great. You nailed it. You guys fucking cooked with this one. That Miyazaki's actual face when he made Half-Light. Huh. I mean, it, it can't get much worse than Half-Light at Soul Level 1, but I think this boss is pretty much always terrible. Hashtag scholar sweep. Don't scholar sweep me. The one-handed attack is a horizontal swig. You mean this? Why do you... I guess, yeah, maybe it's easier to hit a small target like that. Could be good. It has a little more range, too, weirdly. Okay, I will accept. I will accept that one-handing might be better here. And actually just using the shield as it's intended might, might weirdly help as well. Why- I hate those, like... Those bait backstabs. 
Oh my god, it's so much faster. Ooh, it's actually a little slower on the running R1, though. Might be able to get in two hits there, though. I say might be. I'm not actually sure that will be true every time. Okay. Not if he rolls away, for sure. Okay. Roll me away. Yeah, it's way harder to hit to punish that. Okay. It's fine. Ugh. Wow, that is so much faster. Imagine if I block. I will not be locked in a... <sighs> is that at least the last painting guardian? Because if I can kill that guy, I think we're fine, but... Oh, TTS is still 100. If Valentino's here, he could he could turn it back, but I, I don't really care. People haven't been abusing it. <laughs> yeah, being able to wail one-handed is pretty good. And I guess, like, maybe just blocking with the shield is actually wow. a legitimate strat here. Well, yeah, BGB. I know you can fucking redeem, like, 500,000 TTSs now, but... We can't all be rich like you. What do you think this guy's name is? He never really says it, so... You could redeem 3,178 TTSs. Yeah, never mind. Pump that shit back up to 500. Dude, I, I brought it down to 100 last stream and, like, nobody used it. <laughs> okay, very fun. Per usual. Good stuff. Friend named Argo. No. He's incredibly loyal and kind. Shout out to my bro. Our TTS is a hundred. No, you don't have to change it. I'll I'll do it. Let it ride. People weren't exactly using it yesterday, even though that was kind of the point. Good. You're dead? Good. Right, I forget you have a shield. Why do you have a shield? Second question, why do you have a shield? Are you gonna shoot me? Like, okay. 
No, no. Yeah, great. <laughs> he parried you? Yikes. What a terrible boss. Okay. God, at least he has no poise. Here I thought I could get a backstab. What was I thinking? Ow. I lock onto the guardian? Hello? Is Half-Life meant to be more aggressive at this point? Because that's really annoying if so. God damn it, dude. I thought he was going to just keep running at me. Where is Half-Life even? Okay, go try and heal. See what I think about that. Yes, okay, second guardian down. Heal, I wanna top off here. You don't gain any moves, you just keep spamming the same dumb bullshit. Lord, does he love spamming. Ow. That's like no damage at least. I'm dead. I'm not dead. Really thought that one was going to kill me. You know what? I'm not willing to risk this. <laughs> He's just going to let me buff. Dude, and his AI is fucking stupid. Oh, that was really close to being bad. That was almost a fucking wombo combo there. I am alive. Wow, the ember saved me. The ember completely saved me.
Oh, uh, he was about to do <laughs> Yikes. Heal. Keep shooting me. Okay. God damn it. Come on, do it. This is the only attack I'm punishing at this point. And even then, it's not a completely safe punish, as we've learned. Now I'll punish Bo. There we go. Jesus Christ. I feel like this whole fight is just a tech demo for the weapon itself that he has. Bro, that's what I'm saying. That's what I've been saying. God, holy shit. That was definitely, without a doubt, the worst boss at Soul Level 1 so far. Wow, what a painful fight. <laughs> Ooh, look at the cool weapon arts. I mean, to be fair, the Frayed Blade is really fucking cool. Um, okay, let's go back to our Lloyd's shit for Gale. Otherwise, I think we're good. Whew! Spear of the church. Make I'm gonna haste. make haste the fuck out of here. <laughs> Mads! Damn, I, I kinda- I just made the gamba. I said it's not happening in 25. I really felt like that was more than 25 attempts. <laughs> Why is everyone yo what the fucking or what the helling? Believers eating, I guess so. 